All right, guys, here we go. It's uh, it's November, and it's so Cyber Sunday in Survivor Series month. And uh, SmackDown's in Portland. This is a great time to just do an R&R. &R, because they told me to do it. <laughs> so. And I'm going out to the WWE Championship, so. Success, so. Alright, get a phone call. Well, it's Tori. Hey, sweetie, I... I got this web interview thing and and then ch a charity event. Come with me and then we can go on a little day afterwards. It'll be fun, I promise. I want to see you. Love, Tori. Eh. We'll see. More phones. And Tori again. Hey, champ! Oops. I guess I can't call you that quite yet. I'm so proud of you, and I know you're going to win tonight. And I'm sorry, but I'm not going to be able to be there in person, but there's something else i got to do. I w makes me wonder if she's trying to send me up, so... Anyway, we got Jeff Hardy versus John Cena, and then Rick Foot versus Carlito, Candice versus Melina, then HBK and Rick Rude! Oh boy, he came back from the dead! <laughs> Rick versus Umaga and, and uh, Kenny, and then there's me against Warren for the title. Okay, John Cena wins. Then Nature Boy lost to Carlito. Candice beats Melina. And the legend returns to win. Him and HBK defeated Umaga and Kennedy. It's kind of like DX there in a ways. Because Rick Rude was with them for a little while. Here we go. We have a new champ. That'll be me. feeling about this as well. <laughs> because the Tories can take care of personal issues and she's out there in person. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I feel kind of uncomfortable about it, but you never know. There has been weird things going on. Well, plus, that East, ECW can show up again, too. I'd like to be my answer, Tyree, but I can't do that for some odd reason.
I like his first theme better than his uh, second theme. Well, I mean, his current theme now. Plus the uh, remake from the uh, uh, rated RKO as well. Him and Edge had a mix of songs in there. I like that one too. So. I don't know why, just, it's kind of catchy, Randy Orton's first theme. I, I like it. Alright. Show off of the greatest technical wrestler of all time. <laughs> Five time WWF was back then champion, and two time WF Cardinal champion, two time WF tag team champion, King of the Ring, and then part Royal Rumble winner with Lex Luger. There's to say, then down the three king already. Here we go. No. He's a slippery devil. Just how much punishment the human body can withstand here tonight. There's a reversal. Big superstars sing intent of taking each other to the limit. <laughs> Almost. Randy Orton is a genius, JR. As soon as he got what he needed from Triple H and Ric Flair, he turned on him and struck out on us. Look at him feeding off the energy from this capacity crowd. He's unstoppable. You can't ever count on these fans, JR. They're simple, and they'll abandon you in a heartbeat. Jackhammer on Randy. Got a new champ. Ha <laughs> ha. Nice. Okay, so nothing happened. Okay. <laughs> I was afraid it might be, but wait, there's cutscene though. We'll, we'll see. He did it! By God, he did 
<laughs> yes. Uh, feels good to get the title back. Because Henry Reinhardt is nothing without it. Nothing! Nothing without it. <laughs> Same with the, the World Highway title, but that's a different story. Oh! Congratulations, champ! I'm so proud of you! I've already made the arrangements for a big victory party for you. You're going to love it. I also sent you some photos that I think you're really going to love. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Dear Mary Reinhardt, we at Player Catering would like to thank you for your business. We, we, we hope you enjoyed your event. For your convenience, we have de 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 deducted our fee from your salary. We, we will... We know you have a several options for, for, for catering, and, and and hope you continue to to choose player catering. We have deducted our fee of five thousand dollars from your salary. Sincerely, player catering. Okay. <laughs> Title changes, but respect remains. Cyber Sunday is the beginning of him of him and Reinhardt's championship run. As he defeated Randy Orton in a title match, in title match, it was a hard-fought battle for the new W champion to put an aspiring performance, especially with all the controversy and drama swirling around him. As you probably recall, him and Reinhardt's former ally Edge has been making life difficult for the superstar. Even Randy Orton gives praise to to the new title holder. I, I really have to hand it to him and Reinhardt. I threw. My, my my best stuff at him, and he still won. And with all the other uh, other bag Beijing, some sorry guys, give me that right on, on his on his back to boot says Orton. He should be proud of himself, but 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 he better not celebrate too long. I'm going to be coming f to get my title back soon. I'll bring it on. Whoops. Got the phone. Oh, coach. Survivor Series is right around the corner, and I need to start assembling Raw Survivor Series team. There's one superstar in particular who I wanted to evaluate, so I made a match between the two of you this week. Where are you going to be? Survivor Series surprise on Horizon. The Survivor Series is one of WWE's largest and, and most important annual pay-per-view events. This year, it, it may be even be a, a little more interesting than usual. Mr. McMahon, chairman of the board for WWE, tells us he has a, a major announcement regarding Survivor Series, which which is only a few weeks away. At, at the event features all of the company's brands. The possibilities are endless. Mr. McMahon wouldn't in, indulge us any further. However, now... Now is not the time to reveal my announcement, says Mr. McMahon, but, but surfaced to, to say it will shake this company, my company, to its very foundation. Alrighty. So JGG versus Kenny, then Nature Boy versus Carlito, Boy versus Candice, I versus HBK, oh, that's my partner, then the game versus the Legend Killer. Okay, JTG. Okay, Kenny beats JTG. Then the, the Mitch Ward beats Carlito. And my girlfriend wins over Candace. And here we go. Let's see how I'm going to look with a W title around my waist. I just thought something was going to happen because Tori said she had to leave or something. So, <laughs> but it didn't happen. Welcome to 
SmackDown. For Survivor Series is less than three weeks away. This is good old JR Jim Ross alongside my Hall of Fame compadre, Jerry the King Lawler, we're at ringside, and the champion is in action tonight, folks. And this might be a non-title match, but the champ better give it everything he's got. You can say that again. His opponent is in consideration for Raw Survivor Series team. And there's no better way to evaluate a superstar than to put him in there against the champ. I think we can right there. Heck for player catering really had a high price for it, didn't they? Five thousand dollars <laughs> for my salary. the pile behind them. Nah, oh well. Probably t too much money into that. <laughs> about that. I mean, heck, if SmackDown interferes, I'm going to interfere in their matches. Quite simple. Oh, the bell looks good on me, doesn't it? Looks like I was doing Sean Benjamin's entrance, but oh well. Okay, the showstopper, the main event, the icon. Welcome to Raw, coming to you from the land of the Razorbacks, Little Rock, Arkansas. Jim Ross here with Jerry the King Lawler. Little Rock can't wait to see the Raw superstars. This show's been sold out for weeks. These Little Rock fans know that Raw never disappoints, and tonight is no exception. I can't wait to get started. I don't think these 
superstars have any intention of taking it easy on each other tonight. He's going for the cover, JR. That went nowhere. Well, thank you, Jim. which way this one's going to go, JR. Well, from my perspective, this is still anybody's man. I'd like to see things from your perspective, JR, but I'd have to get my head out of my rear end first. And Lord knows it's been up oh, there for so long, but that would be no easy thing. Try five on Sean. Sounds about right. And else you can get it right. It was World Heavyweight Champion, not WWE Champion. So. <laughs> Oops, game bug. <laughs> there. Hey, the game beats the Legend Killer. Main event, main event details revealed. Mr. Man promised big news regarding the Survivor Series, and he, and he delivered. The main event for the event will be truly, be truly historic. In a triple threat match, that the champions of of, of all three brands, Ross, Smackdown, and ECW, will square off against one on against one each, one another. All three titles will will be on the line, and the winner will receive the receive the losers' championship. Awesome! I I said my announcement would be huge, and and, and I'm a man of, of my word, says Mr. Man. I'm also a man who likes to win, and that's why I have thrown my support behind World Heavyweight Champion Batista. Hey, hey, there's me too. <laughs> Nobody loves me. <laughs> okay, let's go train exercise. We'll do speed. Why am I underrated as W Champion? I mean, come on. 
I think Carlito's doing in, 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 independent shows the last time I heard. Don't see him too often anymore. Alrighty. My edge, get up. Drilled it. Success. See here. I'll do endurance. Then after that, I won't do any more for a while. Success. So. Here, I need to feel the love here. <laughs> Come on, I'm your guy too. I'm your W champion. Alright, do an R and R. Big success. Got three message no, no I got two. Hey champ, I bet you're not too happy that the chairman of World Wrestling Entertainment is backing your opponent at Survivor Series. Just wanted to let you know that not every member of the McMahon family feels that way. Sure. Your boss is on your side. Let's get started. Coach, we've 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 got to get you warmed up for for your big match at Survivor Series champ. I'm throwing you right in, into the fire this week. You're you're in a non time match against World Way Champion Batista. Represent Raw and that to take advantage of his chance to peep to, to peep the comp competition. Best coach. ECW has faith in champion. Extreme Championship Wrestling may be the, the new brand on the block, but those with have full faith in their champion's chances at Survivor Series. ECW champion Bobby Lashley definitely has all, all the tools it takes to succeed. His his he's physically imposing deep deep fertility, sorry, fast and and can absorb large amounts of punishment. He he will need all of those attributes to win Survivor Series Triple Threat Main Event, putting him against the champions of both Raw and SmackDown. I have watched Lashley closely throughout his career, and and uh, he's at the top of his game. Says ECW Trump, ECW's Tommy Dreamer. He he is the most dominant force in sports entertainment, and the, those other two so-called champions don't have a, a prayer against against him. Right. Remember the past? I whooped him. Hey, Shani? Oh. You, you, you beat the top power 25. As uh, nice a, as it is to be at the top of the, power, of the power 25, in some ways, it's even sweeter to knock out somebody else who's on top of the heap. This is, this is the stuff legends are made of. Keep going, coach. Listen, I'm going to hear this company from my old man someday, right? So why should I wait for him to decide to retire? If it be my father's favorite at Survivor Series, then maybe the great Vince McMahon will lose some of his appetite for the business. Listen, I've lined up someone who might be able to help you. I'll be giving you a call. Hmm. Help me taking Dad down a, a ping. Okay, I haven't got nobody yet, but here I'm going to check the Power 25. See if I'm on top. 
And I'm not even close. Stop lying to me, coach. <laughs> Alright, Jeff Hardy versus Legend Killer, JTT versus Nitro, Shaft versus Kali, Nature Boy versus Carlito, and I face Batista in that one on one match. So. Okay. Legend Killer beats Hardy. Nitro beats JTG. Kali beats Shad. Then the Nature Boy lost to Carlito. And here we go. Looks like I didn't show any respect for Batista or Shane or Sean there. <laughs> oh well. Bootista. <laughs> if you guys have been watching uh, WWE recently, the fans don't like him. Love him right now for, after winning the 2014 World Rumble. So. <laughs> Come on, he actually won it in, in 2005, but that's when his career was starting to get an up and up, so, I mean, up up. Yeah, to see him win, him, him win it nine years later, yeah. <laughs> Fans don't like it. Too confident. Perfectly. You're not going to get him with 
Oh, he got a kick in the fight. I'm so disgusted with Batista Jr. He could have stayed with Triple H and Ric Flair in Evolution and continued to ride the coattails of two of the greatest legends in this business. Instead, he threw it all away. What are you talking about, me? Batista never wrote anyone's coattails. He's his own man. He earned his spot. And Flair and Triple H are two of the great, no doubt about it. But Batista proved he's at their level when he beat Triple H for the World Heavyweight title. At WrestleMania 21. I would say so, how do you think this one's gonna turn out? That was you? really a uh, Honestly, main event. I have absolutely no I can't idea. say that Shawn Michaels and Kurt in the putting a word more of a match than 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 that uh, main event between the Tisa and Triple H. Oh, it's well, I guess he doesn't want to be lifted up here. These superstars are going to put each other through wrestling hell tonight. They've already got a pretty good start on that, JR. They have indeed, King. I don't think there's an ounce of quit between them. Yeah, and that's where things get dangerous. If you're too proud to admit that it's not your night, you might wind up risking your career. What does he think he's doing? He's just showing off for the crowd now. He's wrestling the match his way. Nice. And I think it's going to pay off, mark my words. Five on you, well, Batista. Second one. Any superstar shows the slightest hint of weakness, they've lost the match. That's for sure. No matter how beat up you are, you can't ever let your opponent know the extent of your injury. And that's easier said than done, JR. The human body can only absorb so much punishment. Got him. Jack Hammer did it. Yeah, well I got news for him. This isn't SmackDown. 
now. And I couldn't be happier about that. I think tonight only feel his desire to emerge victorious at Survivor Series. I just hope our champion feels the same way. Raw's got to come out on top at Survivor Series. We've just got to. And we will. This way. Our dreamer. Congratulations on your victory, champ. But you can't count on getting that lucky again at Survivor Series. With my ECW champion involved in the match, are you sure you haven't bitten off more than you can chew? Oh, yes, I have. I, I've beaten Lashley before. Lightning won't strike twice for you. Okay. We'll do stamina. He blocked it. Nailed it. Uh, I love that close line. It makes him almost turn inside out. <laughs> Okay, let's see here. Here, I'll do a charity event. I'm not doing an autograph signing. Always. Coach, I like to see my W champion keep winning. Do you have a singles match against Kane, Kane Dykstra this week? To keep you motoring on your way to Survivor Series, beating him is important. But 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 staying healthy for, for pay-per-view should be your top priority. Best coach. I'm still 44. Battle for a McMahon uh, alpha male. No one could accuse the McMahons of, of being a um, modern day soap opera, but the, the bad blood in the McMahon bloodline may be more violent than, than ever. Mr. Man has sided with Batista for the main event of Survivor Series, which pits the champions of all three brands against one another. It, it, it seems that son Shane McMahon may want to enlist one of the other participants in the triple threat match in a bit to get the best of his father. There is no problem between Shane and I, says Mr. McMahon. We are, we are as close as we've ever been, and I really don't appreciate any rumors to the contrary. My dad's a great guy. Everyone knows that, says Shane. He, he wants his kids to have it better than he did. 
occasionally I, I want the same thing, of course. Ain't nothing. Here we go. Candice versus Melina. Then the Nature Boy versus the Radar Superstar. Shad versus Nitro. And then there's me against Kenny. Then the game versus the Legend Killer. Okay, Candice beats Melina. The Radar Superstar beat the Nature Boy. And then the Nitro beats Shad. And here I go against Kenny Dykstra. How many times have I faced him? Gosh. Survivor Series is just six days away. Jim Ross and Jerry Lawler at ringside. And can you imagine the pressure our champion must be under? Part of being the champ is dealing with the pressure, JR. But I don't envy him one bit. A loss here tonight would rob him of momentum heading into Survivor Series. But if he puts too much into tonight's match, he might not have enough left in the tank Sunday. Talk about your rock in a hard place. Uh, no problem. I can get it. takes each other to the limit, no matter who you are. Still, I'm gonna give it all my all. I mean, how many times have I tripped five Kane Dykstra? Too many? Jack Hammered? Too many? <laughs> kind of like Chris Masters. Okay, here we go. That went nowhere. This capacity crowd is solidly behind their superstar. Look at this! Wow! Can you be any more biased, JR? How about some fair and balanced commentary? He saw that one coming. Man, I see 
see nothing but bright things in Kenny Dykstra's future. Kenny's a gifted young superstar, that's for sure. But I'd sure like to see a little more respect for the rules. Listen, if you're just starting out the way Kenny is, you take every advantage you can, whether it's on the up and up or not. I just think this kid's got so much potential that he shouldn't need to fall back on cheating to advance his career. Finally nailed it. <laughs> what an incredible performance by these phenomenal superstars. Did you expect anything less, JR? I mean, look who's in the ring right now. No, I didn't, King. I had high expectations, and I'm happy to say that this match has exceeded them all. Sure, if I look in, yet again. I don't think these superstars have any intention of taking it easy on each other tonight. That's not what they signed up for, King. And quite frankly, I think these fans would be disappointed if they didn't go all out. Well, that's easy for the fans to say. They've never set foot inside that ring. No, but they spend their hard-earned dollars to watch what goes on inside it. And without them, we'd all be out of a job. He's got his opponent in a pain predicament. No. Listen to the crowd, JR. I think they've got something to say to these superstars. And if they're smart, they'll listen. Remember, without these fans, these superstars are out of a job. Kenny, I think your back's broken, isn't it? <laughs> okay, but, okay, if anyone interferes, I'm gonna interfere on the show, plain and simple. Arrive, raise hell and leave. I like that shirt. <laughs> and there you have it. The champ has successfully retained his title. This match was probably the most nerve-wracking moment of my life, JR. He took a huge risk. He could have lost his chance to represent Raw in the Survivor Series made it in. Yeah, and not to mention the fact that we could have lost our championship to ECW. Fortunately, neither one of those outcomes came to If ECW can be trusted, which for the record I highly doubt. Well, you said to defend my title. Okay, that was a little messed up, but oh well. For all of you fat. Okay, I will go. <laughs> and the game beat Randy Orton. So. And we're going to a cutscene here. Oh, 
Oh! ECW. Damn it! Uh, I just had this card detailed. Oh. So you think you're too good to defend your championship against my champion? Is that it? I hate one-sided conversations. Now, I gotta go get my car waxed, so I'll get my friend here to help you up. Oh, please. ECW, here I come. Oh, never mind. Looks like a foreign model. That's that's not a dodge. So who should I attack? Dreamer or Lashley? You got a phone call. Coach. The joke's on him. I absolutely cannot wait for Survivor Series. It's called a triple threat match, but with you working with Lashley, it's going to be more like a handicap match. I can't wait to see the look on Matisse's. We need to gang, gang up on him. Best coach. Ah, uh, that's not going to happen. It's going to be a triple threat. <laughs> okay. Dreamer. Lashley. I'm going to evade your show. Eh, the game. Don't you ever, ever attack me. <laughs> or this kind of, this will happen. I swear I've 
it made it more in ECW shows than I did WE shows. I don't know why. Time to get a weapon and start wailing on Lashley. That would be a good match at the game versus Lashley. I don't think, think that's ever happened. Hello. Lashley. Oops. Wrong guy. No, I got Game, what are you doing? Don't attack me. That would be a really good time to stop wearing down a body part. I'd say go for the leg. Sound like a manager. You ever consider that career path? Nah. I'd be too careful to go in that ring and start choking people out. Why? Oh, nice! <laughs> That's nice. One. What do you think has the advantage of this matchup? It's too close Sorry, to game. It all falls down to who wants it the most. And what they're willing to sacrifice to Three. Get. Four. Whoops. I'm digging it too. And you know what? I think this is what I'm better. Is if you make this kind of like pipe down a little bit, so I can pay more attention. Hey, it's a great match. We're here to provide commentary. Talking's kind of our job. Then maybe I'll have to break out my mute button. Also, oh my God. Button. The fans, but as a superstar, they got no choice but to listen to it. But without them, we'd all be out of a job. They're as much our boss as Mr. McMahon is. Last year the match. And you deserve it. <laughs> Dreamer beats Snitsky, Mr. beats Punk, same man beats Elijah Burke, and Lashley beats Marcus.
It's gotta be success. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Okay. I'll do technical exercises. Exercise. Daddy. <laughs> Not anymore, though. She's out of that. Here we go. in a train match? That's odd. <laughs> Got it. Never seen that before. Pinfalls during a training match. Success, nailed it. Ted's leaning up to Survivor Series, that's why. Success! Shane again, you uh, better deliver you on your own. And I will get the job done. So shut up. <laughs> Montreal, Canada. And nothing, no update. So here we go. Candace versus my girlfriend. And Jeff Hardy, Kane, and Sam versus Orton, Finley, and Elijah Webb. That's the, the, the probably the Survivor Series elimination match, the traditional. And Matt Hardy versus Regal in, in First Blood. And John Cena, Undertaker, and Punk versus Edge, MVP, and Marcus Corbon in another Survivor Series traditional match. And there's a triple threat W Championship. Alright, can this beat Story? Who wins the first one? It is Team Orton, and Finley, and Burke. Okay, who wins the first blood match? Matt Hardy. And. Team Cena and the Undertaker Team Punk beat Edge, MVP, and Corbon. Here we go. I'm not running scared. I'll whoop him. No problem. Yeah. 
the game are champions a run for his money a couple of weeks ago. And I'm sure he studied the tapes of that match over and over. I hope our champion did the same thing. Yes, I sure did. What I did in R&R. &R. I was watching Batista's wrestling matches. <laughs> as we want to be. <laughs> well, well, because that prior happens off the tur turnbuckles, that's why. Yeah. Well, I mean, no different than Canes, but Canes is fire. So. This is the biggest match of the champion's career. All Not really. three championships are on the line. Whoever loses the match loses his title to the superstar who beats him. And it's not enough for him just to not lose the championship tonight. The Raw fans want him to take someone's title home with him. Yep, somebody's title. I don't know which one. No. Whoever I pin, pretty much. I might be on ECW. <laughs> I mean, I've been on SmackDown already. Why not? I will try to pin Lashley. If not, it's okay. Something's happening here because they didn't go to a superstar loading screen, so. Oh, okay, no. She's on time. Okay. <laughs> Man, doing this and doing NASCAR championship season, man. <laughs> Gotta get back to my gameplay styles and all that. Just kind of switching back and forth from wrestling to NASCAR. Well, plus I've been playing college football as well, so. <laughs> yeah, it's no big deal for me. I'm used to it.
Jim Ross here with Jerry the King Lawler. And folks, let me assure you that tonight is a lot better than JR's French. Sheesh, well, there's no question of that game. These Montreal fans are ready to get started, and so am Ooh. I. So what are we waiting for? Keep missing him. Actually, you're about to get trapped five again. <laughs> And, and if the Dells gets Trump and McMahon. <laughs> Ooh, ouch. What a phenomenon is the animal Batista. You talk about a force of, he's got the crowd and his opponent in the palm of his hand. That can change the nature, especially if you let your opponent catch his breath. Lashley, that's a good deal. Actually, I just pinned uh, Flash with ECW. It's, SmackDown keeps their title. Well, they deserve it because they're the ones attacking me and they're the ones who betrayed me. So, ha ha ha. <laughs> Here's Coach. Excellent job, champ. Now, I'm sure you, like me, don't want a horde of ECW. 
ECW extremists invading Raw, trying to get their championship back. So I'm returning the title to ECW, but trust me, you'll get something out of this deal. Good. Sorry, I have to let it go. ECW felt belt every office. For winning the ECW championship, you'll receive salary, a bonus of $5,000. Also, you've earned a, a replica of ECW belt to, to put in your trophy case. Congratulations. Sincerely, W Office. Awesome. And W Office, again, salary bonus. Have to prove your salary bonus if you want the amount of $1. Keep up the good work. Sincerely, W Office. Aha. Uh -huh. One stinking dollar. He got fallen in. Dreamer again. Hey champ, how come you ever return any of my calls in Survivor Series? I know that there's some heat and, you know, some tension between us, but business is business, and I hate leaving money on the table. But if that's the way you want it... Hey, hey, hey. Going to, to, to hide... Going to hide behind your partner? You're so lucky you've got a partner to blame for the match you're about to lose. Not only am I going to prove that I should be the number one contender, I'm going to prove that I should be wearing championship gold again, not you. Who's got the bell? Me. All right. GM in search of number one contender. Looking forward to New Year's Revolution. Raw GM John Coachman has been busy considering who should challenge him and Reinhardt for his WWE Championship. This roster is loaded, Co Coachman says. I want to make the right decision. Once, once two superstars not shy about promoting himself as championship material is Edge. Decision? Well, what kind of decision does he need to make? I don't understand how it could be in anyone but me, says Edge. I've been to the top before, and I've done everything I need to do to be there again. You name him, I I've beaten him. This is my f food. This is my air. I, I need that title to, to survive. Coachman, however, is not as certain. In order to evaluate the top contenders, I'm making a team match. It will be Hitman Reinhardt and John, John Andrew versus Edge and Chris Masters on Raw. Edge will have his chance to impress me then. That pretty much that's good enough. Still 44. And 2000 is my salary, pretty much. Okay, here we go. Baltimore, Maryland. JT, JTG versus Umanga. John Cena versus Carlito. Mickey versus Tori. Then Chad versus Kenny. And then there's me and Natro versus Edge and Chris Masters. Umanga beats JTG. John Cena beats Carlito. My girlfriend beat Mickey. Chad beats Kenny. Here we go. I just such a whiner. <laughs> Survivor Series has come and gone. And now, we're on our way to New Year's Revolution. This is Jim Ross, here with my Hall of Fame partner, Jerry the King Lawler. Sure, respect my second side. partner. Yeah, engine masters don't like me because they're my opponents tonight, so. I got some respect from JTG as well, so.
Adios, Star Rocket. <laughs> Here we go. Welcome to Raw, live from Baltimore, Maryland. I'm Jim Ross with Jerry the King Lawler. I know I say this a lot, JR, but I think tonight's show is going to be the best one ever. You might be right, King. Of course, the Raw superstars always seem to find a way to outdo themselves every week. And that should be a surprise. He's not going to get caught with that one. This has all the makings of an instant classic. That's probably just gas, JR. <laughs> well, I did ask the girl up on the barbecue before the night show, but I don't think that's it. Oh, you reversed it. So, how do you think this one's going to turn out, JR? Honestly, King, I have absolutely no idea. Anything can happen here at the WWE, but well, you've got to have a guess, right? I might, but I'd rather keep it to myself if it's all the same to you, King. And reverse. Looks like a tag to me. Yeah, okay. And now he's bringing in his partner. He's got his opponent in a pinning predicament. <laughs> what an incredible performance by these phenomenal superstars. Did you expect anything like that? Kick the head there. Can you believe we actually get paid to do this job, JR? It looks like he's tagging in his partner. Quick tags are the best way to win a tag team match, JR. <coughs> Who just as soon as tell you out 
ass look at you. What are you talking about, JR? That's just a nasty rumor spread by people who wanted to be in Edge's league <coughs> and couldn't keep up with it. Come on, King. You've watched Edge as much as I have. Have you seen the thing he's <coughs> pulled? Talk about someone who pulled as old as the other side of the hill. Well, I'm sorry you <coughs> decided to sympathize with the <coughs> losers, JR. Me, I'm sticking with a winner. I'm sticking with Edge. There's the pin. One, two. I'll do it. <laughs> Doctor says, "Get out of here, Masters." <laughs> Stephanie, hey, uh, little birdie told me. Hey there. I asked my brother Shane for your number because I know you came through for him in a big way last month. I've got something similar planned for this month, if, uh, you're interested. Hmm, that depends what it is. Okay. Don't do a, tr hey, a training exercise. Here we go. Fred. do it. Success. Nailed it. Let's see here. Let's try a villain roll. See what we get. What we get. Oh, failed. Bummer. <laughs> and we'll do a little press conference here, too. Success. And then we'll do an R and R. R, and R. That's on there. And we got a magazine to end off the park. Contender right, race heats up. 
if it's not one thing holding me back, it's another. I don't know why I get saddled with with this dead weight like like this. Is this some kind of a joke? Edge as as the usual is unhappy. I want to get out there and show everyone I'm the best. And what happens? The, they make me tag up with some mongoloid who. who who manages to trip us up and we lose? No, 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 no. He's lost. My partner held me back. And and the so-called champ hid behind his I demand hid behind his I demand justice. Rod GM John the Coachman, however, is st st still has not de declined who's who will challenge him in my heart for the WWE title at New Year's Revolution. If if Edge is so convinced that there are other superstars influence his performance, he'll be pleased to know that I plan to evaluate him. Masters, Natural, and Hitman, and, and Reinhardt e visually when they come to compete in a Fatal 4-Way match. Awesome. So, which means he'll be for on Raw this week. So, so anyway, And I got a phone call to end it off. Oh, it's Coach. Hey, a long way to go. Hey, Champ, I think Edge is getting all railed, railed up, riled up, but when isn't he? And and I know you're anxious to learn how your challenger will be at the next pay-per-view. Let me worry about that for now. Remember, it's a long road to New Year's Revolution, and you need to make sure you get there in one piece. Stay strong, Coach. All right. So this is the month. It's December to to, to December. Then it's New Year's Revolution. Like, hey, where's I'm again for SmackDown? Oh, uh, anyway, I'll be back with December.